Hello everybody and welcome back. This week we are talking about birds. So today I wanted to draw you guys a nice picture of a bird. So if you're wondering to draw with me, let's get our pens and papers and pencils or whatever writing utensil you have. Let's get it ready and let's draw something nice. So for me, I would like to start with maybe a white paper because I'm going to try and draw a peacock today. So peacocks, to me, I'm going to draw a boy peacock because they're very colorful. So I'm going to get a nice blue color, and I'm going to draw the head of the peacock and the body. So you can try your best to draw it however which way you think it should look. This is how I'm going to make my peacock. It looks kind of funny, but that's how I imagine the body to look like. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> I'm going to color it in. Do you see? Okay, so now I'm going to get a beak. I know it looks funny. It looks like a blob, but trust me, it's good. All right, so now I'm going to get like an orange color. If you have orange, go ahead and grab it. I'm going to draw a beak for it. I'm going to draw a beak like right here. I want this to be the face. I'm going to give it a big beak. Because maybe it is a very good talker. Maybe it talks a lot to the other birds. Okay. So there goes my beak. Look, it looks a little bit like a bird now. It looks a little bit like a peacock. All right, next. I'm going to start by drawing the tail now. I know. So if you want to start on the legs, you can continue with the legs or the other features. But I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like. So I'm going to get a nice purple color. Something bright, like a nice bright purple, because peacocks are bright colors. They're very easy to spot. A lot of people like them. All right, so I'm going to get my colors ready at the ready, and I'm going to draw a tail. I'm going to draw the feathers at the tail, because that's where all the peacock's feathers are. It's at the tail. It has different colors, so don't color them all in yet because we're going to use different colors. So I'm going to use this purple color. I'm going to color it in. See, one. And then it's kind of like, um, it's kind of like a colorful turkey. I know, it's kind of hard to say. It's kind of funny to say that, but it kind of is. Now I'm going to get a green color. I'm going to get a nice green color to color, it, color in the next one. I'm going to get a nice green, and I'm going to make another piece of its tail right about here so that it's so colorful. You see? Easy peasy lemon squeezy. There we go. So that's the second, that's the second feather. Peacocks, have, like I said, they have very colorful tails. So now I'm going to get a very light, bright blue, and I'm going to draw another feather. I'm going to draw it surrounding it because the feathers are behind the peacock. And the feathers are very, 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 very big. So I'm going to color it in, you see? Ah, and then I'm going to put purple again because I know they have a lot of purple and pink feathers. So I'm going to do that. So if you have those colors, then you can do it. But you can make your peacock whatever color you want. I'm just using the colors that I have in light for my peacock. Okay, so I'm going to take my writing utensil, and I'm just going to draw a little feather, like right maybe here. I'm going to draw like right there, and then a little bit over his head, because he's a colorful little fella. Okay, so I'm going to color it, and now look at that. Nice and easy, lemon breezy. All right, and then like I said, I'm going to put some, maybe a little bit more green. So, so far we have blue, we have yellow, we have green, we have purplish, we have pink. So I'm going to put a feather right here. We have a lot of colors, and that's very good because like I said, peacocks are very colorful birds. Peacocks are a very, 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 very colorful bird. So now I'm going to put that. I'm going to color it in. Look. And then I'm going to add one more color. I'm going to add another blue color. Just another one. 
Or maybe I'll add a yellow color because we haven't done a nice yellow color. I'm going to do one yellow color, one yellow feather. Okay, I'm going to put it here. Now, hopefully it doesn't color in this color because, oh, it didn't. Okay, good. <laughs> okay, so we have that color. Oh, what happened? I got to color it in. So we have our purple feather, our green feather, our blue feather, our pink feather, another green one, and another yellow one. So now we have the peacock's body. So now I'm going to add some orange legs or maybe brown. I'm going to add brown legs. You can use whatever color you have. I always say that you can use whatever color you have available. So, but I'm going to use brown and I'm going to make some feet. So I'm just going to give him small feet because I don't have that much paper left. So I'm going to give just some small feet. There we go. And I'm going to color it in just like I always do. I always color it in. Ready? Color it in. Wow. And then I'm going to draw some eyes. If you have, I'm going to use a nice black color. And I'm going to use it to draw in some eyes. I'm going to use it to draw in the peacock's eyes right about here. And then I'm going to color the inside of the eye white. So it's a very go-to color for eyes. And then I'm going to get a nice, maybe bluish color to color the inside of the eye. I'm going to draw just a circle. Just a circle. That's kind of a circle. It's a very nice one. All right, and then I'm going to color this one too. And now the inside of the eye is a nice blue color. Okay. And then I'm going to draw just like the, I'm going to use black and I'm going to just draw the shapes that are inside of the, fe the peacock. Ready? So the peacock needs a wing. Maybe it's a nice little tuck in wing. Like this one. And then this is the body. And maybe I can help draw the beak. So I can eat seeds and talk. And then I'm going to draw the feet so it can walk nicely when it doesn't want to fly. You see? And then maybe I'll give it some peacock feathers on the top of its head. You know, for some fun. There we go. Just one more maybe like a mohawk. And then I'm just gonna draw in the feathers too because it has a lot of feathers. Do you guys see it? It has like two feathers each. Because peacocks have a lot of feathers. The boy peacocks have a lot of colorful feathers. And then that's our peacock. We drew a peacock. Look at that. That was very fun. So I hope you guys drew one too. And if you did, I would love to see it. So thank you for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.